Hi Aquarius, it's Elle here to do your weekly reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It means a lot. Please continue to do so. All links are below. If you need to get in contact with me, let's get into it. Thank you God for blessing Aquarius with a clear, concise message from you. All right, so Aquarius, let's see how you're coming into the week. How is Aquarius coming into the week? All right, how's Aquarius coming into the week? All right, ooh, the Nine of Cups, wish fulfillment. Just emotional fulfillment. Just this could even be satisfaction all by yourself. It doesn't mean that it doesn't mean that you're not coupled or you could be coupled, but whatever it is, it just means that you're content emotionally, you're fulfilled. You could even be enjoying life's little luxuries, big luxuries, all kinds of luxuries. Uh, good food, good people, good drink, maybe even new friendship, new love. Um, it just seems as you're coming into the week, just happy, fulfilled, content. You know, I heard it matters. I don't know what that means, Aquarius. What should Aquarius be concerned about this week? What should Aquarius? Okay. The Ace of Swords. So maybe getting some uh, clarity, some truth. Yeah. Getting some truth, some clarity, maybe even clearing out the mental clutter, adding things up, making sure that things make sense so that they can make dollars, right? Um, you need to get to a place, Aquarius, of clearing the distractions. Maybe things are distracting you from your true nature, your agenda that you set for yourself this week. Uh, maybe, you know, you're being pulled here, being pulled there. Again, you need to make some irrevocable change here with the Ace of Swords. Uh, you, something where you can't go back on. You have to really sever ties, cut ties with this. Make sense of something. Make sense of moving on and leaving past situation in the past. Taking to this newfound knowledge, applying knowledge, and then moving forward. So that's really good. That's what Aquarius should be worried about this week. Cutting out the distractions. You know, uh, people coming in, saying this, saying that, pulling you here, pulling you there. All of the the mental agility, the mental jargon, just, you know, cut through the BS. If Aquarius takes the advice, well, what is the advice of the cards? What is the advice of the cards for Aquarius? What is the advice of the cards for Aquarius? The advice of the cards okay the knight excuse me the page of pentacles all right so the advice is learn be a student to this soak up knowledge um the advice is um studious um dedicated uh relentless uh books reading tutelage um apprenticeship getting under someone who can offer you um their expertise here so that you can then take that and you can grow this uh the page of pentacles the advice here is good news about business matters starting things is starting things that have to do with business is coming into you and it's going to be um you know satisfying also the advice here is if you have a lot of different suitors love potentials offers choose make a choice aquarius if if that is what you're dealing with um if aquarius takes the advice of the cards how will the week turn out if aquarius takes the advice okay the page of cups so you got like timing issues here uh, you got timing and a bit of immaturity. Immaturity isn't always like the most horrible thing. It just means that you might need to gain, again, more knowledge about something, uh, more information. Um, you might need to do more. The Page of Cups says having lots of dreams and wishes and being too um, dreamy and too, you know, daydreaming and head up in the clouds and not enough action. So you might need to take action here. Um how things will turn out if you take the advice of the cards is you can start to dream you can start to put things um in order you can start to have your emotions you know associated with 
uh, making your dreams come true. Uh, but it says don't get too emotional to where you do nothing. But um, also y you can have you can just engagement happens here to where you can actually have idea and act on the idea. Um, what is what should the Aquarius know this week? Okay, the Knight of Pentacles. You've got um, angelic presence uh, helping you, a guardian angel, uh, hard work, dedication, loyalty, devoted. Um, this is how you need to show up for yourself, for your business, for your job, whatever it is you do. Um, there might be even travel in terms of work here. Uh, there is a standstill too if this is love and look what came out the emperor so maybe some of you are dealing with uh, a masculine energy um, yeah with justice here and the five of cups here so we've got somebody here who wants to make something right they want to make it right because they feel like they're missing out on something they could feel like they're missing out on you also missing out on the opportunity that is you they feel like they regret not saying things to you or not making emotions known or expressing their emotions they feel indebted to you they feel like maybe they treated you unfair they need to do something um to right the scales or make things right or balance things out or bring some resolve here um, but we do still have a standstill. I'm not sure if this person will come to you and actually do this, but we do have a standstill here. Um, Aquarius, it just looks like you're in a place of just trying to bring in uh, new energies, new things uh, to fruition, business, uh, opportunities, job, um, maybe even um, just new things in terms of your home or or something of that nature let's see what else can we gather here what's going on for Aquarius this week what do we have for Aquarius what do we have for Aquarius there's a need for some of you to date let your guard down get out there flirt date have fun let's see I, this was sticking out beauty queen so some of you had platforms where you get a lot of attention you're living your best life you dress well you look good you take care of yourself you take care of your body again you're getting a lot of eyes on you here maybe in terms of maybe you travel somewhere or you will travel somewhere or you're you go around or you get around not in a bad way but um maybe you're well traveled or um you're just well versed in something here you have that to offer maybe a group of people because people look up to you this beauty queen a card it just says that you're living life on your own terms and how you came into the week is the nine of cups so it's like things are just going well for you you know uh enjoyment fulfillment emotional contentment let's see true love very nice so some of you could have met a true love or realized that someone is your true love while while traveling um also some of you going backwards or someone's realizing that you're their true love because it is a past love so somebody's trying to travel back to you if they have been away from you um they feel like your true love um it's a past love there was a breakup or is a breakup it looks like they want to resurface here what can we tell aquarius in terms of love and then we'll close this out what do we want to tell aquarius about love here let's see what do we want to tell Aquarius about love? Okay. All right. You have not healed yet. Heal. It came in reverse. Maybe somebody's healed. And this person feels like you make them happy or you, or they make you happy. Wow. This person wants to reconcile with you. You're not sure if it's a smart decision, but. The cards are saying come out of fear, fear-based decisions. All right. Aquarius. Uh oh. Whoa. Uh -oh. Somebody wants to reconcile. You're not exactly sure because they put you through some shit. Um, this could be gay, lesbian, bisexual relationship for some of you. Um, this person said anything. They were mild mouth, they were foul, or they did something that um maybe they've embarrassed you 
They tried to embarrass you. Uh, they said things and they didn't mean it. Let's see. Feminine. It could be a feminine energy. It's a loud mouth. Drama field. Just drama, drama, drama. And I mean, if she wants to come back, maybe she has, you know, been involved in gay, lesbian, bisexual relationship. Um, you're not exactly sure what to do here. Let's see. What else can we tell Aquarius in terms of love? Okay. Leaving you out. Maybe somebody was leaving you out, you know, um, because they were lusting or following, you know, their passion, their lust for someone else. Again, unfair. Again, we saw that in the cards and the tarot. It's like somebody wants to come back and make something fair. They want to be just with you. They want to do the right thing because they know they treated you unfair or you treated someone else unfair. They treated you harsh or hard or cold, muscular. They could be muscular. Wow. And then masculine comes out. Maybe a masculine energy treated a feminine energy very hard, cold, unfair, left her out, was leaving her out. But now this person is realizing that you or an earth angel and they found security with you and they are just plain oh addicted to you and they're bothered by you not giving not giving any energy time to this they hope it's just you're not angry anymore um and they hope that you don't feel unsafe with them anymore they want you to come out of feeling unsafe um because they're saying that they've come out of putting others before the relationship aquarius you could have said don't talk to me anymore because you're super immature but this person is addicted they love everything about you they could have made you a doormat but now it's, a, it's like they're going to be the doormat because they found comfortable or comfort with you hmm Oh, okay. So go here. All right. So let's close this out with uh, a few more of the Amira love oracles, and then we're done. It just looks like somebody is just having a hard time without your Aquarius, and maybe they have healed. Maybe they not. Maybe they have not. Only you will know. Um, keep your guard up. Yeah, control. It's like this person is coming to a level of control. Maybe they're learning how to control sexual desires and lust. Um, the the want or the need to just be flighty and just run away and just do all this crazy stuff um it could be a fair male someone who's you know lighter in skin tone caucasian or um just you know light skin um it's somebody that wants to be honest too fair they want to be fair with you again fair is coming up justice then we had unfair now we have fair meal like some male wants to be fair they may even want to give you gifts Okay, they feel like you are a gift. The hand of destiny is stepping in here because it's like, I don't know, Aquarius, you might be done, done, done. Like, and this person is just crazy over you now. Yeah, the relationship probably was karmic. You had something to learn. They had something to learn. Something needed to be illuminated to you and to them. Maybe they finally get it. They want to date you. They had, you had to learn something about dating and they had to learn something about dating too. Um, this person has a new lease on love, life, themselves, and maybe they want to come back and show you. This could have been the Ice King. Somebody has a lot of life experience, maybe smart professor, lawyer, doctor, someone of that nature, um, or just a boss, a leader. Um, and they were really cold to love, maybe even workaholic here, but it's like they are retiring um maybe from a job literally or just retiring that that way of life or that thought process or that philosophy because your sweetness came in and changed them um and they are some of them i'm like they're finding it hard to get out of bed they are missing you um falling ill or calling out sick because they just can't believe that this is over yeah it's like now they're addicted to you stoner maybe some of them are trying to you know they smoking and trying to get over you because it's hard to handle um the fact that maybe you're just not coming back or it's done or they just don't they don't understand if you still care are you still caring um and they want that maternal nature that you or that uh, yeah maternal nature that you bring to them here 
they want to be honest now they want to come to an understanding that they are trying to save uh, this marriage this relationship this situationship this whatever it was they want to save it uh, all the while maybe you could be trying to divorce from it leave it separate this person wants to know if you will i don't know her if you will and your answer might be maybe because you might be saying it just costs too much now it, this could be literal money like oh it costs too much money because the person's asking if you will i don't know what they're what you know the finish of that sentence is but if you will and then you return with it just costs too much now it could be money or it could be emotions like they may be asking if you will allow them to see you take you out on a date and you might be saying no it just costs too much like it costs too much for me to put my trust in you you know therefore i am not gonna do so um yeah somebody's getting trying to get their they body together here too somebody's like um they spent money big money maybe on a, a exercise equipment or are they going to get some type of surgery um somebody to get stronger uh somebody may have gone through accident and they're trying to get stronger here um somebody was over drinking and um spending a lot of money on drinking and drugging and just being out there and their body was taking a toll or, or their body has taken a toll on all of that abuse and now they have changed that about themselves and they're trying to um, be strong or get stronger they're trying to come out of being stuck yeah somebody's seeing things clearly um maybe even getting clearer skin okay okay um this looks interesting to say the least um we'll, we'll leave it here should aquarius trust this energy now it's going to be different for every aquarius okay so if you want to drill down on your energy your situation get a personal reading oh the devil came out this might just be temptation aquarius somebody might just want to get you back on the on a ferris wheel here you got off and they want you back on it um, it says be cautious of the choices you make it could lead you down the road of entrapment says the devil be weary of extravagance well whether that's in your money sector whether that's in you know going over the top in terms of making choices don't be extravagant don't overthink it don't um don't overestimate also um don't go into with you know these grand expectations hmm all right clarify the devil for me then we out of here i know we've been out of here for like three three times now all right yeah the nine of swords it's just like somebody is just it's real hard for them right now without you and it could be aries sagittarius leo a male cancer yeah definitely cancer coming up again somebody seeping into depression uh, because of this uh, feminine energy that they're still holding on to but she's done um, this person could have children somebody try to turn children against yeah somebody try to turn the children against the somebody either you there's somebody doing some black magic here also um yeah it didn't work it didn't no effect is what i heard no avail now somebody is just confused somebody could be trying to use children to get back to you get to you yeah somebody was doing some black magic or something they ain't no business doing um wow yeah aquarius you are protected and guess what you come into the week as the nine of cups so continue that energy and just keep moving forward um, if you want to get your own personal reading Aquarius please go over to the website book there ask a question or two by texting the question to the number below you can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy Ella coffee link if you took something from this reading you can always give back it, it will be used for the channel 
um catch me live every tuesday thursday and sunday night um 9 30 p.m eastern standard time where i do a collective reading and then i answer your questions so uh, thank you many blessings to you take care <laughs>